depending on a merry-go-round with only a stopwatch and a measuring tape. You want to determine your radial acceleration when standing at the edge of the platform and when you're halfway from the edge. So to do this with only a stopwatch and a measuring tape, meaning you only know time and distance, no, uh, we can and we can also know t to define, which we will define as the time it takes for us to go in one full circle. So to find the radial acceleration, let's go ahead and use the force equation. Triple force this that equal to triple because you are moving in a circular motion. If you left and right and triple force. So that we get real acceleration should be u squared over r. Now, e, but since we have distance and time, we know that so e is the distance over time. And what is the distance interval as you go around in the merry-go-round in one one revolution? So that would be two times rate and, and actually. divide that by time, t. So let's go ahead and plug t into the radial acceleration formula. So that we get 2i r divided by t times 1 over r. We can apply this into 2i over t squared times r. Now, Figure out our acceler uh, radial acceleration with only a stopwatch to find and a meter stick, or in this case, a measuring tape. R. And we want to find the ratio of our acceleration between the edge of the platform and halfway to the platform, to the edge of the platform. Let's go ahead and label one as the edge. We want to find a one over a two. So from that we are the merry-go-round is rotating at the same speed for both cases. We notice that this part of the acceleration will always be the same because it takes the same amount of time to go in one full revolution when you're on the very outside. And uh, it takes the same amount of time to do one full revolution outside as it does when you are anywhere else on the merry-go-round. So in ratio, that part will cancel out, leaving us only R1 or R2. And R1 was the very edge, so that R2 is half, half so the R divided by 2. The R is canceled. And half on the denominator flips, so then ratio to t exactly to 